peace, love, and light family. I hope the sun is shining wherever you are. I hope that you are living in your greatest purpose. Let's get into your messages at this time. All right. See something about an eight of cups, seven of wands. Um, something walking towards you. Huh. Something trying to penetrate inside that that wall you got built up, perhaps, Scorpios. Mm -hmm. You got a wall of resilience built up is what I is what I hear. You know things. You're aware of things. Something's trying to walk towards you. And yet you are protected. See the page of wands, the star. Hm. There's beginnings, a lot of beginnings happening for you. Page of Pentacles. Uh, money's coming, Scorpius. All right. Hmm, the Hermit. I'm hearing someone that was in Hermit mode is coming back. Oh, Nine of Cups. I'm also hearing uh they've come up with some creative ways they've become more creative hmm. two of swords okay hmm. someone's tormented or was tormented two of swords upside down so two of swords scorpios usually indicate some um, Someone who's indecisive, stuck at the crossroads. And it could have been that this is why this person was in hermit mode. They were stuck at the crossroads, so they had to go to hermit mode to figure out some things to go soul searching. Mm. Anything else about the hermit? Okay, six of wands, three of pentacles. I'm hearing someone sees you in the spotlight. Someone sees you shining. And they're wanting to build a tapestry with you. <laughs> they're wanting to weave a tapestry with you. Hmm. Do they now, Scorpio? What you saying? Okay, something's coming fast. This may be some sort of spiritual type of thing that this person's doing. I'm hearing that they, they learned new tricks while they were in hermit mode. Hmm. So this is why you went soul searching to figure out ways to penetrate into Scorpio's bubble. They went into hermit mode looking for ways to get creative. Oh, sheesh. Mm. Huh. Who's feeling like this? They feeling a bit lonely. Oh, no, not lonely. Abandoned. more trauma than anything okay <laughs> I'm hearing since I lost my Scorpio okay so who is this let's figure out who this is oh someone wants to come out hmm knight of swords okay knight of swords Um, so there's, there's someone who was in hermit mode. Scorpios. This person is declaring war with you. Yeah, I know. It's like, it's like you've become a challenge to them now. They see that, they see that you see and they know that there's there may be an inkling of doubt in your mind regardless mm, like regarding what they've done it's like regardless of what you know spiritually they think that you may there there may be a door a crack open okay and it's like i'm hearing this person has now become some sort of a strategist or they were all always some kind of a strategist. Okay. And I'm hearing also that 
they see you as this military strategist. They see you as someone who strategizes and thinks before you act. They see you as someone who is one step ahead of them. And it's like you've become a challenge to them. And it's almost like this sick, narcissistic person um, who, who finds some kind of a thrill, you know, because you're a challenge to them. You're a challenge to them. You're a military, you're some sort of like a, I'm hearing some sort of a military strategist. Like some of you may have been some kind of a military strategist in your past life. And this person, they see your spirit, they see your energy, okay? They saw that you, they saw that they set a lot of traps that didn't work. And they went into the hermit mode asking, why, why is this? They're soul searching. They weren't looking for, they weren't looking, it, it wasn't, it wasn't a positive thing. Let's just say that, okay? Like, their state of meditation, what they think was meditation for them, is taking time out to rethink what it is that they're doing and why it is that their traps are not working. They went into hermit mode and they uncovered that you are some sort of a military strategist. You're always one step ahead, Scorpios. And this is why they're always losing. This is why they're always losing. and and. They're losing what? Hmm. They're losing because you're protected. They're losing because they see... See? This is absolutely confirmation because the emperor is a protector. Okay? The emperor is a protector. And when it comes with the knight of swords... And look at this. The magician too. You have the ability to plan and strategize one step ahead of whoever it is that went soul searching, looking for ways to cause your downfall. And when they went looking, what they found was that you are a warrior. You are a military strategist is what I'm hearing. You're a protector. You're a protector of protectors. And as many of you may have some sort of a you know fire sign in your chart you may have like some fire energy in your chart many of you may also walk with some deities that are connected to fire energy warrior energy military strategist energy mm. and part of the reason why they're not able to defeat you is because you have a very strong heart chakra, very courageous. You are tapped into your heart chakra. It's balanced. Okay, where it may not have been previously, it is now. You're balanced. You know, you have... Ooh, Scorpios, look at this. When you have fire and air together, this is... You are someone whose flames burn so bright, if they're not careful, they, it will burn their ass. And I'm hearing that whatever it is that they're doing, it's only fueling the fire. It's causing air to rise. It's causing air to make the fire rise within you. And you're not even angry. You're just manifesting. Mm-hmm. You're just manifesting. And many of you, the fire that is... The cause of this fire is you speaking your truth. Spirit is letting you know that the cause... What is fueling this fire within is you speaking your truth. And the more you speak your truth, the more you manifest, the more you are able to walk in the path of the divine. And, the, and also the more you're able to escape. This is the energy of escaping traps. They went into this hermit mode, Scorpios looking for ways to destroy you and they found out that you're a military strategist and this is why you've always been one step ahead and this is why you've always escaped their traps this is why you've always managed to 
creatively create your path create your own path like when they block one path it's like you become this fire and the flames burn bright and you burn whatever's in your way and you create another path you're able to escape you're able to move forward always move forward always okay nine of cups tell us about this nine of cups nine of cups <laughs> Oh, Nine of Cups is you and your wish fulfillment, Scorpios. You are looking good. Mm, Spirit is saying you're looking good. You're smelling good. Mm, you are abundantly abundant. <laughs> yes, you are abundantly abundant. Mm, you're seeing the signs and symbols as they come to you. You have this light within you that illuminates the world. You are a treasure, Scorpios. In this wish fulfillment energy, you're getting your wishes fulfilled because you are a treasure to many. As the Empress, the Emperor and the Empress shows up. Straight up boss energy, straight up creativity energy. They haven't even been begin to understand the level of success that you're about to come into you are accomplishing all of your wildest wildest most precious and abundant powerful dreams and you're working on this you're working on this you've been working on this this is your cycle of abundance spirit wants you to know this you walked into this cycle of abundance and look at this. The nine of pentacles appears twice as above. So below the divine is letting you know that the divine, the hand of the divine is all over this. The hand of the divine is all over this. You ain't got to worry about a thing. Uh, you ain't got to worry about a thing. Your new beginnings are guaranteed, honey. <laughs> yeah that seven of wands that we saw earlier with the sister inside of the bubble protected as the wands comes towards her that's that energy that was coming forward they've thrown their wands oh have they thrown those wands they have thrown whatever weapon that they can think of spiritual physical they've had people come in sheep's clothing watching you some of you have actually seen these folks literally watching you and whenever they come they always get the same thing nothing <laughs> uh, they, they they come to gather information they come to set traps and every single time you wave that wand they throw seven they didn't know that you already had ten mm-hmm look at that look at that there's seven you match that and then some because the divine is always here protecting you watching over you let's see about this two of swords um uh, tell us about this two of swords this two, two of swords is coming upside down okay so just a quick reminder what's in your energy scorpios this is what's in your energy this is what you working with, Scorpios. Mm -hmm. You got the Hermit card, Earth Energy. Okay. Virgo Energy. Many of you, you may be dealing with an actual Virgo here. Yeah, this this Virgo. Mm -hmm. This Virgo <laughs> is the one that's trying you. Some Earth sign, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Okay, you got the Hermit earth energy nine of cups water energy two of swords this is having to do with mind communication energy three of pentacles abundance actually it came like this six of wands wands you know give me this gives me the energy of creativity this is you know abundance energy so there's a lot being said here about this person okay we already know that they went soul searching looking for ways to penetrate that bubble that spirit has protect you and protected you in and they have uncovered exactly who you are while you're while they were in spirit mode they uncovered that you were a military strategist 
and you are a military strategist and this is why you've always been able to be one step ahead scorpios this is what i'm hearing uh-huh okay so this is about them right away this is about them two of swords all right this is them coming out of hermit mode thinking they know shit now okay they've come out of hermit mode where they were stuck at a crossroads now they come out and all these crows are nibbling at their heads mm, they're troubled they're perturbed because they see this queen of pentacles rising to her power rising to his power they are having some issues at this time scorpios because they came to literally i'm hearing pull the rug under scorpio's feet that's what they came for they came to pull the rug under scorpio's feet and then they found out that it wasn't just the queen of pentacles that was there it was a king of wands it was a cycle of fortune okay and there as much as they think that they've had some clarity spirit is saying you need to go back you need to go back into your hermit mode honey okay because you still stuck at that crossroads you know sadly mistaken thinking that you can overcome you can destroy the scorpion you're still blinded go back to your meditative state mm -hmm. go back and do some more work spirit is saying go back to hermit mode because you ain't done yet because you still blinded you still blinded to the truth you still blinded to the truth of humanity you're still blinded to the truth of the potential that spirit has scorpio you are a military strategist you've been here before you've fought these wars before you've seen these games you foresaw them and this is why you've always been able to avoid traps mm. They wanted to cause some kind of, you know, mm, some kind of thing with your with your money. Uh, that energy that came before regarding your finances, you know, something about it was built by design. You know, that was one of those energies involved in that. Uh, the Six of Wands. I'm getting this energy that the Six of Wands may be you, okay? Uh, the Six of Wands may be you. You are someone who ha you're someone who have your own business, okay? You're someone who have your own business. You're standing resilient. You know how to fight these battles. Why? Because you are a military strategist very persistent courageous walking in your courage you've got a backbone you're not afraid to take on goliath is what i'm hearing <laughs> you're not afraid to take on goliath three of pentacles let's see and this spirit is also saying that they see you whoever it was this virgo and i'm getting the sense it may be an earth sign virgo capricorn taurus strong virgo energy here um they see the divine working in you they see the divine working with you to bring you your beginnings you're shining you're in the spotlight here your creative powers are really really um flourishing like you are abundant dripping you know in your success here dripping in gold like the child of oshun that you are mm. Mm. yes indeed Yes, indeed. Uh-huh. Three of Pentacles. Oh. Three of Pentacles. All these came upside down. That's interesting. But the first one that's actually ca catching my attention is, you know, things are coming together for you. Weaving the tapestries, that energy that I got earlier you are manifesting your greatest desires that's the energy that came before 
and whoever it is this this tapestry that i'm getting is like they literally are consistently coming up with ways to rebuild this tapestry to rebuild their schemes their plans every time they see that it's not working they come back to what they call hermit mode and and their hermit mode honey it, it, it ain't no soul there. They went for soul searching and mm, they obviously didn't find anything there. Because when you go into hermit mode, you're supposed to get in touch with your spirit side. And this person is like, I'm hearing like whatever it is that you do, they think they can do it or they want to do it. They have intentions or desires to do it. And so them going into hermit mode wasn't about you know spiritual elevation for real it was about finding ways to scheme finding ways to you know to bring you down because they've uncovered that whatever it is like any time that they set some some kind of trap it didn't work hmm They're having to regroup. It's like, it's like, and I'm hearing they. So this isn't just one person, Scorpios. Spirit is letting me know this is why the Hermit card showed up twice. Mm. This is also representing your spirit guides. There's many of them. There's and 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 the two of swords came out. You see that the hermit mo the hermit and the two of swords came out twice. Spirit is letting you know this is representing multiple people, and this is why I just heard they they are regrouping, and the term regrouping implies that it's a group of people. It's a group of people, not just one because they actually thought that sending that Virgo would actually be the thing to cause your downfall. They didn't want to show themselves because you would uncover exactly what's going on. You would uncover that this is a plot. This is something that is bigger than you think. And so when they sent that earth sign to handle business and the earth sign couldn't, but the earth sign found that there were a lot of barriers. Earth sign found out that they were dealing with the magician here. That I'm hearing for some of you, they've always known. They've had an inclination. They didn't really know how strong and powerful you are. They didn't know that you were one that caused tower moments consistently over and over again. They're having revelations about your power as a magician. This tower card is a revelation that they're having here this this group that is regrouping they are uncovering that they are <laughs> that you are the cause of their tower moment you are the cause of their downfall their bankruptcy that's what they saying and what they didn't realize you look at this the hierophant the hierophant and the magician <laughs> They haven't even begun to understand how powerful of a spiritual being that you are. They're uncovering that you don't walk alone as the Hierophant. They're uncovering that your knowledge of the esoteric goes far beyond earthly realms or any book that they've ever read. Your ancestors are the Anunnaki. Your ancestors are from outer space. You're an outer worldly being with God consciousness having a human experience. This is what they are seeing. This is the epiphany that is coming to them. And they see you walking carefree into your abundance. Mm -hmm. They see you protected. And they're feeling restricted. Hmm. This is a dilemma for them. Yep. This is a dilemma for them because the tapestries that you are weaving has to do with your transformation. 
and this cycle that you're in your intuition is being elevated all i hear is upgrade 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 your heart chakra it's like heart chakra you're working on your heart chakra you're working on your your throat chakra speaking your truth your third eye is uh mm. you're enlightened your enlightenment you're in your period of wish fulfillment this tapestry that's weaving this you get to know this tapestry represents the upgrade in your eyesight where you may have had one previously the upgrade is you've gone two more levels up in your spiritual upgrade in your sight you're able to see and this is why you're able to play and win their games and now they are left in a state of conflict your ancestors want you to know that they're behind you before you on your left on your right all these conflicts that they're coming into they're finding out that they're fighting each other the battles that they're fighting now is against one another because they're not winning this fight mm -hmm. they gotta go and find find new things to do new beginnings for you and finances this is exactly the opposite of what they wanted to see okay additional message regarding this reading spirit okay so spirit is letting you know this devil here represents powerlessness they're losing their power they're losing power they were all puppets they're losing power okay you are coming into this i'm hearing philanthropic energy you are receiving from the divine what you have always sown in your life this six of pentacles here is the divine coming to your assistance and giving you everything that your heart has always wanted many of you you've always wanted children you've always wanted to build your family spirit is letting you know god is not done with you yet god is not done with you <sighs> all right you are going to be you are in your wish wish fulfillment you're in your wish fulfillment uh this four of wands always gives this energy of soul tribes coming together family coming together your spirit family your team of angels your team of support that's coming towards you okay so spirit is reminding you these low vibrationals they're losing power they're losing hope because they see you coming into this energy where you are getting all the assistance that you need in order to walk into your wish fulfillment. And this, this was the nightmare that they didn't want to see. This was the nightmare that they didn't want to see because once you get into this, you are a giver, Scorpios. The Six of Pentacles energy always gives this energy of being a giver. You're a giver. And so many people didn't want you to have because they knew that others would have once you come into your abundance. And this is the energy that Spirit has for you. All right. All right. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Let's see what the ancestors want to say. Okay. What message? Oh, this one came off fast. Mama Killer, Mandela of the Moon. Mm. You also have moon energy working with you, Scorpios. Blessings of Kumu, no good thing shall be withheld. This is. The divine telling you that no good thing shall be withheld from you you are getting exactly what it is that you have sown the seeds that you have sown are coming back to you this is why the six of pentacles is here this is why the four of wands is here and you have the nine of cups coming out twice so you are in your wish fulfillment absolutely in your wish fulfillment okay Let's see what Mama Killer is saying. Number 35, Mandela of the Moon. 
all right number 35 mandela of the moon 35 35 35 okay let's see so this is the word of the ancestors this is the word of mama killer and she is saying mama killer mandela of the moon i lunar mother bring you my mandela of the moon to manifest through the law of magnetic attraction my mandela is the sacred portal through which your dreams intentions and visions shall pass into the wholeness of being from the realm of inspiration into the world of form on earth there's no need for doubt or concern for even the appearance of delay signifies that the divine feminine mystery is at work with timing unfolding according to a higher loving wisdom trust that a falling away is meant to be have faith in new divine works being born wow wow scorpios and and this is why when this card came up i heard the divine said god is not done with you yeah god is not done with you you're just getting started and you are here for it god is not done with you yeah god is not done with you you're just getting started and god is here for it your ancestors are here for it you are here for it what they did not want to see scorpios you standing strong and standing still and standing powerful with the energy of the moon and how relevant is it that we are in a full moon energy and mama killer mandela of the moon comes forth and shines and says be still and know that all things that were promised to you all things this family this abundance the child that you wanted it is here it is coming to you okay you are protected you are loved you are powerful and you are the military strategist that they tried to figure out how and they're still searching trying to figure out how let them while you continue to elevate and continue to walk into your enlightenment and this is what the divine has for you this is the message that the divine has for you if this message resonates please like comment share and subscribe until next time love peace and light